Hello and welcome to the course. My name is Hisham Saad and I will be the instructor for this course. I'm a senior regional cybersecurity technical specialist with more than 15 years of cybersecurity, specializing in digital forensic, SOC operations, SIM management, and advanced security analytics with threat hunting. I participated to a lot of regional and a global cybersecurity conferences and events, presenting the latest cybersecurity trends, fracturing to help and improve organizations' SOC operations and SIM management, including the latest security postures, guidance, and recommendations practice. That's all about me. So let's take a look on what this course is all about. This course primarily focusing on how to share the best practice of deploying SIM security information and event management secure solutions using the best practice, the guidance principles, and how SIM solutions as a modern next generation of a SIM solutions can offer a real-time monitoring and analysis of events, logs, tracking, locking security data, operational data, audit, monitoring, compliance, and this specific course in details, we will learn what do you mean by the next modern generation of a SIM solution and an advanced security analytics platform. Not just a traditional legacy SIM for storage data and log management, but more into kind of an analytics, computing, machine learning, AI patterns, threat hunting, intelligence, enrichment, correlations, and automation and more. And then we're going to show how you'll be able to build and design multi-tenancy SIM architecture and not just relying on a single innocence, single infrastructure model. How you'll be able to collect data logs from any data source, cloud, on-premise, hybrid model. How you'll be able to leverage artificial intelligence and machine learning models for detections, behavior analytics, generating insights, anomalies and high fidelity alert and incidents by going to building custom detections, analytics rules, use cases, which is a clear mandatory requirement by any SOC requirement for next generation of a SIM. And last but not least, we will show how to build automation rules, playbox, custom workflows for custom integrations, or even to provide a triage or remediation response capability. So to get more details into the course roadmap, this course being divided into 10 sections. The first section I'm gonna show is you a quick introduction and overview of security information event management SIM solution. What do we mean by next generation of a modern SIM comparing to the legacy one traditional? What are the main key aspects of a SIM solutions? And once we have a quick introduction and overview, it's really important to jump to the architectural design and role-based access control from a role-based, based on roles and permissions, or even from an attribute or a source level. You think a single or a multi-tenancy deployment architecture and the base access controls with identity access management layer. And once we define the architecture, the designs, the permissions, and access rights with roles, it's really important to cover the best practice during the onboarding and the deployment phases. What are the main key prerequisites in terms of configurations, deployment, and SIM? And once we onboard and doing the deployment and set the infrastructure level, going to the data collection phase by having data connectors, custom collectors, and once you collect the data from any data source, on-premise, hybrid, or a cloud, really important to parse the data and to normalize the data into structured sets and then starting to doing hunting, analysis, and detections. And then going to the detection rules, specific use cases, how to visualize the data, how to visualize from an investigations and forensic process with analysis. Going to the enrichment by providing a highly confidence detections and enrichment with data by integrating with any cyber threat intelligence feeds or indicators. Regards which kind of a data types and formats, and we'll go into details. Is it an open source OSINT? Is it specific protocols? Is it built in house based on imported scheme? And then going to the analyst phase, going from a threat detections, from a case incident management, 
from an investigations and running forensics to even automations for using a sole layer embedded or custom playbox with custom workflows and triage and then going to a really important layer apart from the course of map about the query based sim and how the next generation sim solution provides a capability to write and use a query based language for more integrations correlations aggregations and forensics and then at the end we will have a conclusion and sharing the key takeaways from out of our course it's really important to highlight the prerequisites and the prerequisites these are the main minimum hardware requirements that we can use during the course and these are the software requirements that you should have ready in order to follow the practice the demonstrations and the use cases i think that's all we need with that so here we go and let's get started